House Bill HCCR 2001. Short title, initiative, single subject, title. Uh, this bill is being introduced by uh, Representative Kavanaugh of uh, LD23, and it will be heard in the House Government and Elections Committee on the 20th, which I believe is uh, Tuesday. Uh, this, uh, for those folks that don't know what HCR stands for, this is a, a, a House concurrent resolution, and uh, some of these concurrent resolutions, not all of them, but most of them, are bills whereby if the bill is approved by both chambers, then instead of uh, going to the governor for a signature, it goes to the people for an approval. This one happens, and it can be one of two. It can be just a regular statute, or it can be a, uh, an amendment to the Constitution. This one happens to be an amendment to, to the Constitution, which means it takes more to get it, uh, to get it going. But anyway, uh, what it does is what I refer to as a truth in advertising when it comes to, um, to initiatives uh, because uh, there is or there appears to be a common practice among people who create initiatives that they have a title for the initiative which sounds really good and then within the body of the initiative there is other provisions that are not clear from, the, from just reading the title. So when an individual decides to vote yes or no on the initiative, uh, then uh, they are not given full information about it. Uh, so some of us are not particularly crazy about either citizens uh, initiatives or even the ones like this, uh, which are initiated by the legislature. We're not crazy about that. However, and we're not crazy about the fact that you can amend the Constitution with a, single, a simple majority. We're not crazy about any of that. However, as long as we're doing this, as long as that is the case, then, uh, then having something like this would make uh, a lot of sense because if you're going to be voting on something, the title should really give you a good idea as to what it is that you're voting for. Uh, you shouldn't have to read with the magnifying glass all the provisions inside. Although you should, you should read the bill, you should read the amendment, you should read the initiative. Anything that you're going to approve or disapprove, you really should read it. Realistically, though, most people don't. In, 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 in a real world, people are going to look at this and they, and, and they say, oh, this initiative does that. Eh, that sounds good. Not realizing that when you get into the uh, body of the bill, of the initiative, uh, uh, there are certain provisions that you, you may not be all that in favor of. So this, I, I, I like this bill. I, I think it should be a yes uh, for that reason, even though uh, the whole idea of amending the Constitution uh, so easily is not, it's not something that appeals to me. Doesn't appeal to me either. But it doesn't appeal hey, to me on a, on a totally different reason. We, we As I've told something. you before, uh, amending your constitution to enact a, 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 a statutory law is a very poor way uh, of running your legislature. It's just, you know, it's not the way to do it. Uh, you're, you're making your constitution so complicated that no one will ever be able to understand it. Uh, and, and using it to enact laws is just totally wrong. So that's my reason for saying no. I think this is a very, very bad bill, but only for that reason. Now, if it were a regular statute in which they were amending a statute, then I'd be in favor of it. But I'm not in favor of amending a constitution, no. Well, uh, again, uh, I am not in favor of amending the constitution in this manner but we don't have the luxury of deciding that. Uh, all we can say is, here's the status quo, this is what's happening, do we want it to be this way? We want it to be different, and in my case, it, we want it to be different. Well, but Jose, we can change it. All we have to do is have a continuing resolution or an initiative that says we cannot have an initiative to enact a statutory law by amending the Constitution. Right, right? and if that... And, and, uh, but we're not ever going to get that. But, well, uh, but if, if, if we had that kind of initiative, I would be the first one, you know, to, to approve it or to... No, uh, you'd be second. 
Well, okay, okay, no, you be first, and I'll be second. Okay, we'll 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 see who can run faster. Yeah. Okay. okay. Yeah. To get to the polls. But, but, but this it, is totally ridiculous. Totally. Uh, yeah, ridiculous. I know it's ridiculous, but it's better than what we have, and that's why I say mm -hmm. yes. You say no on a principle. I say yes mm -hmm. on practicality. I understand. Is I that understand. Do, do we in agreement on that? I understand. <laughs> okay, folks. Yeah.